call her like how my shim, how chef, my shim, how the best, all right? Peace and blessing, the great meal, stone up, pasta, and whatever's on down, move well. Peace and salutations to the house of David, the lake man who's, uh, who's pushing his truth and faith seriously throughout the four corners of the earth, all right? But yeah, like right, this is uh, part two, you know, my, my, my camera only let me go to a certain point on YouTube, all right? So, um, yeah, I'm going to start back. Um, I was in Jeremiah chapter 7, verse 30. For, I'm going to skip to a For the children of Judah have done evil in my sight, said the Lord, Yahweh, and Yosai. They have set their abominations in the house which is called by my name to pollute it. You, you, you set. And this is the Lord's sanctuary. We're, we're the house of the Lord, man. We're where the Lord is supposed to dwell at. But two third, thirds of Israel, the Lord don't dwell within you, man. All right. So because you have set up in, in his house or his spiritual house and his and, and in the actual land of Israel, you set up abominations to pollute it, man. All right. You you set up uh, wickedness, man, eating bacon, man, and pork and, 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 and fucking barbecue ribs, man. All right. And, man, just you, you niggas have... have have done everything to to piss the all you do all abominable things, man. You homosexuals, man, lesbians, man, bisexuals, man, trisexuals, transsexuals, man. All right, just just damn complete demons, man. All right, Lord, Lord's tired of this shit, man. All right, this is Jeremiah, also in Jeremiah five and three. O Lord, are not thine eyes upon the truth that thou, thou hast stricken them? But they have not grieved, thou hast consumed them. But they have refused to receive correction. They have made their faces harder than a rock. They have refused to return. Y'all make y'all faces harder than a rock against the words of the Lord, man. You refuse to return to the Heavenly Father, man. So guess what? All right. You, you, since when you, were, when you refuse to be corrected, when you refuse rebuke, all right, how you going to know what to do to uh, change? All right, how you going to know uh, how to... How to uh, Put yourself in the correct manner so the Lord can help you. Because man's goings are of the Lord. So how can a man then understand his own way? You have to uh, be directed through your, uh, the power of Yahweh by Shem Yahweh So if you're not doing what Yahweh by Shem Yahweh told you to do, how are you going to be directed? Because you're not you're not taking the correction, man. Because you niggas know it all, man. All right? And, and that's how you're going to get killed, man. Because that's that's the blindness. That's a stumbling block, man. All right? For, so the Lord can destroy you, man. All right? Because the Lord hasn't uh, actually... Because it goes back to the Lord hasn't predestined you uh, to be uh, for salvation, man. All right? That's why you're going to get destroyed. Okay? This is uh, Jeremiah 5 and 11. For the house of Israel and the house of Judah, the whole house of Israel, and Judah, you Judite niggas, but you primary, you niggas are the worst of the worst, man. All right? You niggas, man. You can't reason with a damn Judite nigga, man. You can't reason with the northern king. But the northern king, they more... Just completely blind, like these niggas are just what? <laughs> like they they don't give a fuck. They'll take a beer and them issue cards primarily. They'll stay in the house twenty thirty together. All right, in, in the one two bedroom, man. All right, with with a little bit of uh fucking a little meal, man, and, and work fifteen to sixteen hours for three dollars an hour, man. All right, they don't give a shit. All right, and and, and going on down to you other northern kingdoms who. Who will sell your children uh, to the so-called white man just to uh, get fucking uh, citizenship in America, man? All right, but you Judite niggas, y'all, y'all the same way, man. Y'all give y'all children to the so-called white man. You let your children be a sodomite or, or a lesbian and go to the damn prom, or, or 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 go or go do some wickedness, man. Man, you fucking man, bro. You, it's just crazy how wicked you niggas is, man. All right. It's crazy, but you refuse. You niggas got it all. You swear y'all got it all, bro. But this, the Lord has has mingled a perverse spirit on you people, man. All right. So this is uh Jeremiah five and eleven. Okay. Man, I'm really I'm tired of being around you niggas, man. All right, I, I I'll be glad when the Lord just comes to destroy you, man. All right, I gotta get more in the Hebrew so I can start sending up them Hebrew curses on you niggas, man. All right, cause boy, I I'll be so glad when the Lord come kill you niggas, man. You you niggas not trying to serve the Lord, all right? It's like 
Because you, you've hardened your face up like a rock, man, against his word. You've hardened your face up like a rock against the Heavenly Father, man. All right, that's why the Lord has put your ass in derision, man. That's why your ass is hard like a rock like that. The Lord has hardened your heart like uh, ancient Pharaoh, man. All right, you stiff-necked, rebellious house. And a rebellion is a, a sin of witchcraft, man. And, and the Lord should not suffer a witch to live. All right, this is uh, Jeremiah 5 and 11. For the house of Israel... And the house of Judah have dealt very treacherously against me, said the Lord. Y'all dealt very treacher treacherously against the Lord, man. You you some fucking slime balls, man. All right, some a, a slut ass woman, man, who who uh tell you she going out with her friend, man. All right, your your your, your wife, man. She tell you she going out with her friends. Really, she going to get fucked, man. All right, by another nigga, man. All right, dealt treacherously, man. Let me see what this word treacherously mean, man. All right break these words down, man. Lord say you, you you people have dealt treacherously, man. Alright. Being damn demons, man. I'm disgusted with you people, man. Cause this is the true love when you when you speak this word. To, to wake Israel up when you speak this word to Israel this is the love of the Heavenly Father and this is uh, showing open rebuke is better than secret love man you niggas don't appreciate uh, rebuke man alright alright treacherous traitorous <sighs> you niggas have been traitors man Back, turn your back on the Heavenly Father he created y'all funky ass man alright and, and go uh, put your faith in God and Jesus Christos alright Jehovah May the Lord kill you, man. All right, disloyal. You niggas are disloyal, man. All right, you niggas ain't loyal, man. Y'all, y'all holla all that. Oh, these hoes ain't loyal. Oh, these niggas ain't no loyalty exists no more. You niggas not loyal, man. You not serving your Creator, your Maker, man. What you mean? Faithless. You niggas are faithless. You don't have no faith, man. All right, unfaithful, unfaithful. That's all you niggas are. Just unfaithful niggas, man. All right, deceitful. You. You niggas have dealt deceit, been deceiving to the Lord. And they were deceit, and deceive goes back to a, a devil. You niggas have been devils towards the Lord, man. You've been completely in opposition of, of, of what the Lord created you to do, man. All right? Deceptive. You niggas are deceptive towards the Lord, man. False. You niggas fake as fuck, man. Fake ass niggas, man. Backstabbing. You, the Lord uh, look out for you, and you stab him in his back, man. The heavenly father, man. And you niggas, and that's all you niggas do. You niggas do this. You know who the Lord is speaking about through these scriptures because this is how Israel acts and this is how Judah acts, man. Are right, these these just regular codes of the streets, so called? How these niggas are, uh, this is how these niggas will be in the streets, man. All right. Double crossing. You niggas are double crossing real quick. These niggas are double crossing real quick. This just regular shit. Just dealing with regular uh, parts of life, man. All right, these niggas is double crossing, man. All right, they'll double cross you quick, man. All right, double dealing, man. You're dealing with 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 two people, man. All right, say say uh, they fuck with you, but meanwhile they fucking with your enemy too. All right, double dealing ass nigga, man. All right, two faced, you niggas two faced this. Ooh, <laughs> boy, this is this is powerful, man. So why do you have about shimmy off shot by shimmy off dash man? This is just this is, I'm I'm getting edified from it. Untrustworthy. You niggas are untrustworthy to you have dealt untrustworthy. You have been untrustworthy to the Lord, man. Unreliable. You niggas <laughs> you can't rely on no damn Jake, man. He's not gonna show up on time. He you you give him some money to do your man, you can't rely on no damn Jake, man. I'm sorry, man. These niggas is not gonna these these niggas are slothful. All right, idle. All right, and, and, and the minute their emotions get involved, they they go co completely forget the task they had. Right? All right, it's a dicey man. Oh man, man, you nigga, boy, dangerous, hazardous. You man, you have dealt dangerously. You have been a hazard to the Lord, man. Pre precarious, man. Unsafe. Risky, you. Man, you niggas are a risk factor, man. All right, fucking with you niggas, man. All right, you you, cause cause the Lord has uh, you have keep telling the Lord you gonna uh follow His laws. Then okay, Lord, we gonna get right. We are gonna do it now. And you niggas go back to right. Go and you wax worse and worse, man. You go back 
and, and do something worse, 10 times worse, man. All right, that's why the Lord said he's going to force these laws. And, and I'm going to get that too in this, man. He going to force the laws on us, man. All right, because you niggas, you niggas are deceivers, man. All right, two-faced it, false, man. All right. And, and you, this is how you dealt with the Lord, man. You and your forefathers, which you are your forefathers, man. This is Jeremiah 5 and 19. And it shall come to pass when ye shall say, Wherefore doeth the Lord our power all these things to us, then shall thou answer them like as ye have forsaken me and served strange gods in your land, so shall ye stra serve strangers in a land that is not yours. Ooh. So this is why the Lord has forget forsaken you, because um, he, he made you a holy people, brought you to a holy land, okay? You forsaken the Lord and the Holy Land and His law, statutes, and commandments. All right, and, and, and you served other gods. All right, this is just like okay, you got a woman. All right, and you give her everything in the world, man. You deck her out with pearls, diamonds, man. All right, she got a house to uh, stay in, man. A car. You give her uh, children. All right, she don't have to uh, work. All right, she she don't have to worry for nothing, man. All right, and she in your house. Fucking another nigga. She invited another nigga over to the house to uh to fuck him in your bed, man. All right. That's this man. Damn. Imagine how that would make you feel, bro. All right. So that's why the Lord has put us in a land that we don't know and blinded us and smited us. All right. With no understanding, not even the understanding of the name of the heavenly Father, man. All right. And and and, and uh and, and and made us serve. Uh, people in a strange land that we built up, man. We we serving the fucking caveman, man. All right, we we. It's just this is hell to think about, man. This like damn, bro. This this is fucked up, man. All right. I'm gonna just jump down to twenty five. Your iniquities have turned away these good things. Your your iniquities have turned away good things from you, man. That's why you're going through the shit you're going through, man. Because your iniquities, man. All right? So we got to bear the indignation of the Heavenly Father, man. Because we went off against him, man. All right? What? What the fuck? If you can't take the punishment, if you can't do the crime, do the time, don't do the crime, man. All right? All right? You fucking niggas. You niggas don't have no problem. Uh, you niggas don't have no problem selling uh, fucking bricks. All right? To get and then you'll do your little bid if you gotta do your time for it. You don't got no problem uh being a, a convicted felon with a strap and you'll do your time for it because you you'd rather be judged by a 12 than carried by six. All right. So if, if you you niggas don't have no problem doing that, you, you shouldn't have no problem uh bearing bearing uh these uh curses that the Lord has put upon us for coming against them who created us, all right. But you niggas, oh man, I don't want to serve the Lord if he if he feel like that. Man, you niggas, man. Fuck you niggas, man. All right? Every single one of you two-third pieces of shit, man. All right? May the Lord kill you, nigga. All right? Call all your how about shim, y'all was shot by shim, call Kodashi. Destroy you niggas, man. Real soon, man. Your iniquities have turned away these good things, and your sins have withholding good things from you. Your sins have uh, hit, and I'm going to read down a little bit more to them, all right? For among my people are found wicked men. Yeah, you among the people of the Lord are found wicked men, man. All right, damn devils, man, deceivers, man, two-faced, false niggas, man. All right, they say, and your sins have with Osalakin. They lay wait as he that set up snares. They set a trap. They catch man. So you niggas, man, bro, this describes you niggas to a T, man. You niggas so wicked. You wanna. Oh, you, you set up snares of your wickedness to bring niggas into your wickedness, man. Through your rap music, through your your rap culture, man. Through your fucking thug culture, your trap culture, your trap music. You, man, fuck you niggas, man. You niggas ain't did shit for the Lord, man. Not nothing, man. You're dishonorable vessels, man. You're that dishonorable seed. It's a, it's a cage full of birds, so are their houses. Full of deceit. <laughs> so the house of Israel, man, ain't nothing but full of devils, man. All right, just like a cage full of birds just flying around, flapping everywhere. Birds of a feather flock together, man. All right, that's the, that's the same way you niggas are full of this bird. That's why the Lord say birds of a feather flock together, man. All right, you niggas are, are all deceivers, man. All right, one, one come one, 
the apple don't fall too far from the tree, man. All right. It say, therefore, they are become great and waxing rich. You niggas have become great at wickedness, man. And, and that's the truth, man. You niggas are the best. You know how to whip the pot. You, you can break the pot, break break your wrist whipping the pot. All right. You, you niggas can uh, uh, pour a four in a 20 ounce, man. All right. You can uh, remix the dope. You can you can uh remix the dog food, man. All right, you know you know how to uh hide the shit. Even in prison, man, you got these niggas still in prison know how to finesse the the the, the weed and the dope through the threads of their shirts, man. All right, and get into the prison since you got these niggas know how to throw the phones over over the fence, man. All right, these niggas know how to finesse the the guards into fucking them, man. Just. You niggas have waxing rich and, and wickedness, man. All right, they are waxing fat. They shine, man. You niggas, yeah, you niggas be shining and stunting off your wickedness, man. All right, you niggas got on all these gold chains, man. All right, you know, fucking roll it on my wrist, you know, fucking rims on the whip, you know, stunting, man. Baddest bitch or the baddest bitch of wickedness, man. All right, not not our righteousness. Okay, they say, yeah, they overpass the deeds of the wicked. You niggas more dicked, wicked than the so-called white man. The so-called white man be looking at you niggas tactics like, damn, I need to use that, man. All right, you niggas have waxing rich and waxing fat and wickedness, man. All right, they say, they judge not the cause, the cause of the fatherless, yet they prosper. You niggas don't even care of, 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 of what, like, if somebody, what situation somebody going through, you don't care about, uh, like, you don't, you don't care what this man got going on. You don't care about his past situation, nothing, man. You niggas are just backstabbers and traitors, man, to your own people, man, to your own brother, man, all right? You don't give a fuck, man. You still make a dollar off this nigga, and if he, if he not doing wickedness, then that's his fault he ain't getting nowhere, man, all right? Nigga, you 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 should have you should have hustled harder, man. You should have sold more dope, nigga. Or you should have robbed more niggas, man. You should have killed more niggas, man. You should have fucked more niggas, bitches, man. You should have pimped on more hoes, man. They say, and the right of the needy, do they not judge you? You don't even care, like, well, you niggas are careless, man. You niggas don't have no heart. You spiritless, man. The spirit of you is not upright in you, man. You niggas. Are, are, are more wicked than the actual wicked, man. You from the house of Saul, man. All right. And I got this in Jeremiah also, man. And it's just like, damn, when I think about how wicked you niggas is, I just, I don't even want to be around you niggas no more, man. I'm disgusted with you niggas, man. You niggas, all you niggas want to do is play, man. You know? Like, shit, man. Man, I, like, I got a, all right, I'm just using testimony. Like, I got a, close friend, you know, from the world, you know, and I tell this nigga about the Heavenly Father, man, you know, he completely rejected or whatever, and he asked me for a favor, like, this nigga still asked me for a pepperoni pizza, man, but I already told you, if you don't stop eating pork, the Lord gonna kill you, bro, like, isn't that, so is that pepperoni pizza that important to get killed for, man, why, because you niggas are wicked, man, two-faced, man, deceivers, man, all right? Fuck you niggas, man. Alright. This is Jeremiah 4 and 22. For my people is foolish. You niggas is foolish, man. Damn fools, man. Stupid ass niggas. He, he the nay nay folks. I don't give a fuck. I don't, what all you niggas do, man? Fuck you niggas, man. In the club, bopping. Throwing money at a fucking slut nasty bitch in the strip club. Just foolish, man. Walking down the street with your damn pants sagging. All right. For my people, it's foolish. They have not known me. You don't know the Lord, man. All right. But you niggas swear you know the Heavenly Father, man. Every single one of you, man. Oh, oh, I got my own relationship with God, man. I believe in God, man. Hey, man, I pray to the Lord every night, man. He dealing with me. Man, the Lord say, he, he don't know you niggas, man. He say, they are saddest children. You niggas are stupid as fuck, man. Idiots, man. All right, dumbasses, man. Worthless, man. And they have none understand. You don't understand shit, man. All right, you swear you got all to understand. You niggas don't understand not a damn thing, man. 
You understand how to be wicked. You you are of your father the devil. You say they are wise to do evil. Yeah, you niggas wise as hell to do evil shit, man. All right, you like I said, you niggas can break the pot, man. All right, you niggas can break the pot with the dope, man. All right, you can scrape the sides, man. All right, you niggas can uh pump uh stuff some point foes in, in, in the uh nick bag, man, and, and make them look like a fat ass nick, man. All right, you niggas can pearl pearl a swish of sweet, man. All right, roll the hell out that bitch where it burns slow, man. All right, you niggas. You you niggas can do anything. We can, you 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 niggas know how to uh uh get a uh nigga wife number while he not looking. You niggas wise to do evil, man. You say, but to do good they have no knowledge. You don't have no knowledge to how to do good. All, only thing you know how to do is be a wicked ass nigga, man. That's the only thing you know how to do, man. Is just be wicked and serve other gods, man. I'm disgusted with you, niggas, man. I, I see why the Heavenly Father has put us, put us in, why we in the situation we in, bro. I see, I see now, man. Like, man, through, through much sorrow is much grief. And let me get that real quick, man. Through much knowledge is much grief. I understand that now. Now I'm now I'm starting to see like this, like damn. Just with this this lesson through this lesson, I'm seeing like as 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 wisdom and knowledge grow. Up, let me just read it, and I'm I'm just starting at seventeen. It says, and I gave my heart to know wisdom and to know madness and folly. I perceive that this is also a vexation of spirit. You niggas are a vexation of spirit, man, because that's all you niggas is about is madness and folly. That's all this world is about, madness and folly, man. All right? You get your mind to know uh, uh, folly and madness, man, you realize this ain't nothing but a uh, vexation of spirit. This whole earth is nothing but a vexation, man, of, of your spirit, man. You know? It's a... For in which, in much wisdom is much grief, and he that increases knowledge increases sorrow. Man, this this is making me sorrowful just doing this lesson, man. On you niggas, man. All right, to to know how wicked our people, that how low we've been brought, man. Man, this is like this is hell, man. This is hell, man. And these and these people refuse to incline they they, they ear to hear too, man. This is this is sorrowful, man. This is pitiful, man. This is pathetic, man. Dead, man, you niggas are dead, man. This is six and eighteen. With so like wisdom of Solomon, six and eighteen, as love is keeping of her laws. All right, and her laws meaning wisdom, because wisdom is likened unto the wit uh, a woman. So keeping, uh, which the only wisdom comes from the heavenly Father, you have by Shemiah Shah. So the keeping of the laws is the only love you can have. You niggas. Say with your mouth you love the Heavenly Father, but you're not keeping these laws. You, you don't love the Heavenly Father, man. All right? And first and foremost, you need to be calling the Lord by his name, man. Not calling up. You don't even supposed to suffer a, a false God name to come out your mouth, man. All right? It say, and love is the keeping of her laws, and the giving heed unto her laws is, is, is the assurance of incorruption. So, you you want you you are sure not to be uh incorruptible you know if, if um if you're sure to 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 not be corrupted with if you keep these laws man all right that's 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 how you uh that's how you assure uh, uh, of of being okay man you keep these laws man that's how you show the lord that you love him man all right not through lip service man all right not not with your own personal heart of how you believe that you love the lord man all right Let me go to the rope, man. Damn, man, this shit just... It's soft, man. You just, man, you get disgusted sometimes, man. You just be wanting the Lord to just come get you, man. This shit is... This shit not where it's at, bro. This is Baruch 2 and 10. Yet have we not hearkened unto his voice to walk in his in the commandments of the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah, that he set before us. We haven't had, we haven't uh, hearkened to his voice, man. You niggas still not hearkening to his voice, man. You got the prophets all throughout the internet, man. All right, from uh, the apostles and elders on down, man. 
all right? You got them all throughout the four corners of the earth. You niggas don't have no justification, no excuses no more to why you're not serving the Heavenly Father. So you, you see you niggas been doing the same shit. You been transgressed. You been wicked ass niggas, man. And fuck you niggas, man. This is Maya. It's lucky, bro. I'm getting kind of pumped up, bro. I just thinking about two wicked ass niggas, man. All right. This is Nehemiah 9 and 16. But they and their but they and our fathers dealt proudly. And, and, and pride is hateful for most the most high and man. Alright. Pride come for destruction, nigga. Alright. They say, but they are and our fathers dealt proudly and hardened their necks and hearkened not into the commandments. You you niggas refuse to hearken into the commandments of the Heavenly Father, man. Alright. You you harden your heart. You harden your necks. Alright. You know it all. Alright. I, I, I worship Jesus in, in this household. It's, uh, 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 I worship our law. I'm with our law, man. I'm with the brotherhood, man. Oh, uh, I'm part of the conscious community, man. All right. Uh, God is love. God is all colors, man. Dang, bro. It's John. St. John. Chapter 5. Verse 3. It says, And these lay a great multitude of important folk, of blind, halt, withered, waiting for the moving of the water. Okay, and hold on. Is this the right one? It's a lot here, bro. But, uh, man, this might not be the problem. Let's see if I got it. It's in the other John. It's a lot here. Bear with me, brother. That, that's not the precept I wanted. All right. This is John. Yes, yes. Here we go right here. To Wadi Yahabashim El Shabashim El Kodash. This is 1 John chapter 5, verse 3. For this is the love of Yahweh by Hashem Yahweh Shai, that we keep his commandments and his commandments are not grievous. Just keep his, his commandments not grievous. It's not hard. Most, most of these commandments is for your own well-being, man. All right? Don't eat pork so you don't get parasites in your body, nigga. You don't uh, get diabetes and heart disease and be a fat slop, all right? Uh, don't, don't shave the corner of your beards off so you don't get razor bumps and be looking like a damn little baby, all right? Don't get lineups, all right, so you be looking like a cute-ass woman, all right? Don't uh, drop your hair down to your shoulders, all right? Get dreads, all right, because somebody can grab them in battle and, and just take you down, all right? Don't smoke weed because that's invoking demons, all right? Don't do drugs because those are killing yourself, and, and, they, and they fuck with your mind. They also invoke demons, man, all right? Only eat herbs to heal yourself, man. The Lord give you all the, the commandments. Keep my uh Sabbaths, man. All right, so you don't overwork yourself, man. All right, uh, 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 don't don't burn incense to me on the, at this time, man. All right, like, don't sacrifice certain sacrifices to me. Like these are all for your own well-being, man. All right, but it's not grievous to do this, man. All right, this is for your own well-being, okay? But you you niggas don't understand that, man. All right, it, man, it's, this is not. You, you're not meant to do what you think you're supposed to be doing, man. You're meant to do the commandments of the Lord. We was created to serve the Heavenly Father. You weren't created to serve mammon or serve your damn self or, or serve your woman or serve your kids, man. You was created to serve the Heavenly Father, man. This is Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear the conclusion of this of the whole matter. Fear Yahweh and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. This is the whole duty of man, man. It's not grievous to do this. This is your whole duty of being put on the earth, man. It shouldn't be grievous for you to serve the Heavenly Father, man. This is why you was put here, nigga. 
you weren't put here to do shit else, man. You weren't put here to be no damn big time rapper. You weren't put here to uh, have the most chains and fuck the most hoes. You wasn't put here to uh, drive the fastest car. You wasn't put here to uh, take your talents uh, to South Beach. You wasn't put here to take your talents across the world. You wasn't put here to uh, to, 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 to do whatever the fuck you want to do. All right, you was put here to serve uh, the heavenly Father and follow His commandments. This is the whole duty of man. What, what, what the hell you think you was put here for? Let's see, man. Let's see, man. This is a rock. Chapter one. This is Sharak chapter 1 and 15. She have built an everlasting foundation with men and she shall continue with their seed. To fear the Lord is fullness of wisdom. So you niggas lack wisdom, man. All right. You you don't have no wisdom. You Let me start from the top again. All right. This is uh, Ecclesiastics, also known as Sharak. I'm going to start at 14. I'm going to start. I'm going to start at, at, at I'm gonna start at 12, all right? Well, let me just see, hold on. All right, all right, I'm gonna start at 11, so like, this is Sirach, also known as Ecclesiastes. I mean, Ecclesiastes, also known as Sirach, uh, chapter one, verse 11. The fear of the Lord is honor and glory and gladness and a crown of rejoicing. You niggas obviously don't fear the Heavenly Father because you, you don't have, you get, you, you got a crown of, of mirth within this world, man. You got a crown from Satan, all right? You got gladness of, of, of wickedness, man. The fear of the Lord make of a merry heart and give of joy and gladness and a long life. Hey, and, and, and boy, this is the beginning to a long life, all right? Uh, Lord willing, I could be a part of the lick coming into this world because I ain't never lived until I came into these scriptures, man, all right? To just this little bit I know for this little bit I've been in here, man, this... I, I I have a merry heart, man. All right, I catch hell, man. But I'm just happy that the Lord is supping with me, man. All right, and, and I I don't have to just be blind, man. Right? The Lord didn't show mercy on me, man. You know, it's a whoso fear of the Lord, it shall go well with him at the last, and he shall find favor in the day of his death. You are gonna find favor in the day of death, man. If you if if you fearing the Lord, man. All right. You gonna find favor in the day of death, man. All right, you niggas don't find fear the uh, heavenly Father, man. So you're not gonna find favor in the day of death, man. And how you know you don't fear the heavenly Father? Because uh, you niggas lack wisdom, man. All right, and fear is the beginning of instruction and wisdom, man. You niggas don't have no wisdom or instruction. All right, I'm gonna come. Right